Alright guys, so what's up guys, Airball here, back in our video, and today I'm showing you guys the best 6'9 defensive anchor build on NBA 2K23. So this is a defensive anchor, but it can shoot, alright? So this build can shoot, uh, I guess 99 blocks against Hall of Fame anchor. Uh, I mean, it's a defensive anchor, obviously, so uh, Hall of Fame anchor is going to be kind of good. Uh, 92 driving dunk on this build as well, so you will be able to get the elite contact dunks, uh, pretty good standing dunk as well. And like I said, this build can shoot, so it's going to be really solid, make sure you stay tuned. Uh, but yeah, it's in the video, so I'm gonna go uh, center for the position. 6'9 is gonna be the height, uh, the weight is gonna be 230, and the wingspan is gonna be uh, the max, which is 7'7. So 230 for the weight will get us that 80 speed. So 80 speed is gonna be really nice on this build. You're gonna be like very, very fast, faster than like a lot of the other centers in this game. 80 close shot, uh, we're gonna put the driving dunk up to a 92, like I said. So 92 driving dunk will get us that um, elite contact dunk package, which is gonna be pretty solid. We're gonna put the standing dunk up to an 80. Now, look, I would put it to a 90. Um, but you can't even get like the elite big man contact dunks because you need to be 6'10 So I'm just gonna put it to 80. Uh, but yeah, that'll get 17 finishing badges So like I said the shooting you can shoot on this build The problem is you cannot have higher than 80 three-pointer because if you have like an 82 like the 82 three ball It will give you the name uh, two way inside out score and we don't want that. This is a defensive anchor type of build This is a catfish. So 79 is gonna be the three ball uh, 69 is gonna be the mid-range and then the free throw is a 63 that'll get uh, 15 shooting the playmaking pass accuracy is going to be a 66. Uh, ball handling is going to be a 43. That'll get us five playmaking badges. The defense, interior defense is going to be an 87. You need to have a high interior defense to get the name defensive anchor. Or else it'll be called a paint me. So, like, I usually don't have the interior defense that high on any of my other builds. Uh, but to get the name defensive anchor, you need to have a pretty high interior defense. 74 is going to be the perimeter. Uh, the steal is going to be a 77. Uh, the block is going to be 99. So, that's the max. 84 in the offensive rebounding and then 93 in the defensive rebounding so 93 defensive rebound will get us that uh gold rebound chaser 99 block with us will get us off anchor and you get an 87 into your defense too so this build is going to be insane on defense along with having eight, that 80 speed and 74 acceleration the strength is going to be an 82 uh and then we're going to put the vert up to an 83 so 83 vert is going to be really nice like for grabbing boards and stuff and keep in mind you do have a 92 driving dunk so you will be able to jump like really high like you know what i'm saying like trying to dunk um but yeah then the stamina is going to be a 95 uh we do have a few more attributes remaining here uh let me see i, th I think i put the ball handle down yeah i'll put the ball handle down a little bit uh get that steal up to a 78 and then let's see can i put the i can put the free throw down a little bit i'm gonna get the pass accuracy up to a 67 um yeah get up to a 67 then i'll just put the rest on free throw uh, but yeah, that's the build. So 17 finishing, 15 shooting, 5 playmaking, and 27 defensive badges. Really solid for the badge spread. It's a total of 64 uh, badges on this build. I accidentally clicked back here. Um, but yeah, the takeover is going to be uh, rim for the primary and then glass for the secondary. You could go sharp take, but that will basically give away the fact that this build can shoot. Uh, and yeah, this is called a defensive anchor. So it's a Ben Wallace, uh, Robert Williams, and Clint Capella. Alright, so more of the badges. We're going to put a uh, bully, posterizer, slithery. Uh, Limbo's takeoff is going to be gold. Uh, then we're going to put a fearless finisher and then masher on bronze. The shooting, we're going to get catch and shoot. Uh, green machine. Then we're going to go uh, volume shooter. Corn specialist, claymore. Um, and then I guess just, I'll, I, ugh, I can't talk today. I'm going to go guard up on bronze. But the uh, playmaking, we're going to put, let's see, I'm going to put break starter on silver. Then we're going to get um, post playmaker on bronze. And then I'm going to put bailout on bronze as well. Now the defense, obviously we want to go Hall of Fame anchor here, uh, then brick wall, clamps, uh, and then I'm going to put challenger, uh, interceptor on silver, I'm going to put chase down artist on gold, box out beast, you need that gold rebound chaser too, uh, post lockdown on silver, and then let's see, we got one more badge point remaining here, I'm going to put it on pogo stick, get that up to bronze, uh, but yeah, this is the build, um, if you like it, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, I post every single day in this channel, um, so make sure to stay tuned for daily uploads, and yeah, anyway, this is Airball. Peace.